Losing a loved one to fentanyl. Families right here in Bear County sharing their stories, which will soon be seen around the world in the form of a documentary. Today, the night team's Camilla Juarez was invited to watch one of those documentary interviews right here in San Antonio. One family told her it's helping their broken hearts heal. I need to tell people, how do I do this? The real life stories of real life people. Everyone needs to know. It, it needs to be told. A pill that was not what he thought it was. The one pill from a friend. These are all families who lost a loved one to fentanyl. They're called angel families. They're all sharing their stories for a new documentary, hoping it will save someone's life. Many are from our own South Texas community. Jake wanted to live. He, he had a future and that was stolen from him. Martha Johnson from Shirts lost her grandson Jake after he mistakenly took a fentanyl-laced pill. She says it feels cathartic to talk about him. They're sharing our stories and we're, people are listening. And, and to us as the ones that are left behind that are hurting, it helps us and, and we, um, we heal. What are, what are those shining things that you remember about it? Glenn Muse is the director for Texas Pictures Documentaries and let us sit in on some of the interviews. We can make eye contact with the subject and the subject makes eye contact with us. Showing us how he makes the families more comfortable by using a device that blocks the camera. It's impactful. The documentary is connecting angel families together you know, the guy. through the interview process. I'm like, oh my goodness. That sounds like my story. Mm -hmm. I could relate to that and it helps me. But also online. Muse says the project started with a few dozen interviews on YouTube. Each video has nearly 50,000 views. And they're finding this series and finding some comfort in seeing that they're not alone. Now, as you can see, the documentary is still in the works and won't be released for at least another year, but you can see interviews with Angel families right now on YouTube. We have a link to that on our website. Camilio Juarez, KSAT 12 News. Important to share those stories. And last month, we had a fighting fentanyl town hall discussion right here on KSAT 12. Now, we spoke to several people who have had personal battles with fentanyl and also some who have lost loved ones. The entire goal of the special, start a conversation with your kids and loved ones about the dangers of this deadly drug. You can watch that special right now on our website by just scanning the QR code you see on your screen. Keep up to date with all of San Antonio's top news, weather, and so much more by clicking the like and subscribe buttons below. And once again, thanks for watching KSAT.